Hey, hey, good morning. It's uh, Monday. Uh, it's about 3.55, 3.50 a.m. on my way to the office. I'm actually looking at my phone right now. I left it on the top of my car last night or when we were at the car wash and it ended up falling off the back of the car. Thank God that it was saved. It was spared. Uh, it was beat up pretty bad, but it turned right on and uh, all my important contacts and data is on there. So surprisingly, that probably would have pissed most people off. I just kind of assumed it was another distraction thrown my way and the phone turned on and everything was ready to go. So business as usual. Um, took Friday, Saturday, Sunday off. Friday spent that uh, doing miscellaneous things. Saturday spent that with family all day. Sunday spent that at service and then again with family all day, cooking food, hanging out. Um, you know, one thing I learned about my family inside of my house, um, I still have a lot of growing to do. I have a lot of uh, understanding what it means to uh, have the position in the world that I have inside of my own house. Uh, with that being said, being the uh, being the, the the alpha male, being the father, the the husband, uh, being the the one who is uh, going to have to step up and really kind of handle things. Not saying that Ricky doesn't do that, just saying that my responsibilities and roles are a lot different than uh, than hers are, and hers are a lot different than mine. That's not good or bad. I'm um, just really talking about being able to embrace the role that I have and uh, being able to do it to the best of my abilities. So that's a good thing. Uh, Friday, uh, the reason why I changed my schedule up to make Friday a day off was because I was giving it so much Monday through Friday that I had no time to take care of any personal business. I had no time to take care of me. I had no time to take care of, uh, you know, if there was anything else that I needed to do. And what it did was it caused a time crunch inside of Saturday and Sunday where I couldn't really dedicate myself to my family. So after speaking to a couple of important people and really kind of uh, coming to a conclusion or, or seeing if that was the best uh, route to take in order to free up more time, um, the, the answer that came back to me was yes, take off Friday, every Friday. Um, the thing is, come today, I have to go at it harder and harder, which is easy because I was able to prepare and put some systems in place Friday and a little bit of yesterday. I had my wife working with me on some other systems. Um, so ultimately, it's been a really good, uh, it's been a really good experience. And as long as I provide and I produce Monday through Thursday, uh, Friday will continue to be a day that I have off. So you might not see me come on Facebook or record anything. Um, but that's a really good thing. The new system that I have right now or the new habit that I have right now uh, with regards to my spending. My responsibility is walk around with this pen and paper all day long. And anytime I spend something, I need to account for it. Like I've already spent some things. And the reason for that is to make sure that I am in touch 100% with my spending habits. Now, some people might say, well, why would you need to do that? Because with when you are working towards having a lot, um, if you have horrible spending habits with what you have, those habits don't go away because you get more money. Matter of fact, those habits magnify themselves even more. Typically, you'll start seeing TVs in every single room. You'll see multiple purses. You'll see multiple cars. You'll see multiple of everything that you shouldn't have. The only thing you won't start seeing multiple of is multiple bank accounts. You won't start seeing multiple savings account. You won't see multiple, multiple income streams. Um, so with poor spending habits creates poor spending habits going into a different tax bracket. So that's another habit that I'm going to do. I, I bought a three pack, one for me, one for Ricky. Um, and I asked if she would you know, participate in this uh, brief survey and uh, write down everything that she gets. Either we get to a point where we stop buying things because we don't want to pull this pen and paper out or this pad and paper out, or we're able to sit down and look at where money is going and able to distinguish our either our good spending habits or our horrible spending habits. Either way, um, another thing that I'm gonna adopt this week. Um, so once again, it's a, it's a beautiful day making sure that I'm uh, in adopting habits that uh, make sense to me, make sense to my family. So uh, getting this Monday started off great. Uh, it's supposed to be monsoons getting ready to come through. 
but I'm excited about getting back in the office. It's just four o'clock. My wheels are already rolling in reverse as we talk. So with that said, y'all have a blessed day. Talk to you soon. I'll let you know how my day turns out. All right, peace.